Hey everybody, Jeremy Bell, aka Peppers in Kentucky Living. Hope everybody's having a great morning. Um, got two sauces here. I'm going to review from Tim Myers at uh, Hot Heads Official. It's uh, two of the uh, medium heat ones. Um, got one here, which is phantasm it is a ghost pepper and honey I love ghost pepper shake it up a little bit and one i've been wanting to do for a long time uh, a lot of people like peach cobbler and he's got a peach cobbler hot sauce it is habanero and peach so uh let's do the um phantasm first says it is scary good and uh, check out that yellowish color isn't that awesome it's got bits of spices pepper in there love it on the bottle it says hot heads hot sauce hot sauce not for you but for us using the freshest ingredients creating unique recipes and amazing flavors that we love let's start the hot heads rebellion and um, he does got some awesome sauce, y'all. And you can get uh, some Phantasm at hotheadsofficial.com. And uh, ingredients are all natural ingredients, which I like. Which is sweet onion, orange bell pepper, white vinegar, red ghost pepper, honey, garlic, olive oil sugar salt and black pepper i do see black pepper and the uh, red ghost in here and um just love that yellowish color to it consistency is about like a salad dressing so uh put that there but here at peppers in kentucky living we only use one spoon and that is the taste of heat Mother of Pearl Tasting Spoon. And in this case, zips open. And I'm only going to say this one time throughout this whole video. But please make sure you get one. Because it's handcrafted. No spoon is alike. You only taste sauce with a spoon. If you taste sauce with a metal spoon, you're tasting sauce and metal. If you taste it with a plastic spoon, you're tasting sauce and plastic. I don't want to do that. Y'all don't want to do that. So go to www.johnnyscoville.com and get you a Mother Pro Chase E Tasting Spoon because we'll never use another spoon again. I mean, I promise y'all, y'all won't want another spoon. All right. Oh, wow. Now, his sauces, and I mean, I'm looking at this one too. Yes, they, hold on, let me see here. A lot of his sauces are with orange bell and olive oil. When I smell this, I get the olive oil, I get the sweet onion, Just a little bit of the vinegar. It's not overpowering, y'all. Can smell the sweetness, you know, from the honey, too. Black pepper, the garlic. So I, I cannot wait to taste this. And this is a medium heat. Here's the pour. Creamy sauce. Lots of spices and pepper. All right. From Tim Myers and Hot Heads Official, this is Phantasm, Ghost Pepper and Honey. Jeremy Bell, aka Peppers in Kentucky Living. Wow. Wow. Great flavor. Great medium heat.
going to put the spoon up, but uh, I will be tasting this again. What I am getting, wow, is a sweet onion. The orange bell is a key in here with the uh, olive oil. Um, do get the vinegar, not much, not overpowering. Do get the red ghost. Tongue right here. Some on back of the throat. But it the ghost hits you more in the tongue. And uh, it does. I mean I feel it right here too, just a little. But it'll hit you more in the tongue. Do get the honey. Do get the sweetness from the honey. The garlic, olive oil, wow, right off the bat. Do get the sugar. Okay, there's definitely a sweetness. Salt and black pepper, yes, but not overpowering. You get all these ingredients, you can taste them all. They're blended well. Wow, it's just that. But I'm telling you, that orange bell pepper is a key too. Love the ingredients that Tim Myers puts in his sauce. Fresh ingredients, all natural ingredients. Um, really, really good. But um, it is a medium heat for a non chili head. I'd probably give it a six. For someone eating hot stuff, I'd give it a uh, probably a three or a four. For me, it's about a one and a half. But, um, wow. i tell y'all what, this would be the wing sauce, good salad dressing. Um, I use a lot of sauces on my breakfast. But, like I always say to y'all, y'all put y'all sauce on whatever you like. I cannot tell you what to put your sauce on, only... I put hot sauce on certain things. Y'all put hot sauce on certain things. But enjoy it. That's all I'm saying. Enjoy your hot sauce. Go to hotheadsofficial.com and get you some Phantasm ghost pepper and honey because y'all will love it. And uh, I will put the link in the description. Now, we are going to one I've been wanting to review for a while. And I do have all of Tim's sauces. So this one is the Peach Cobbler. Habanero and peach. Life's a peach. Delicious, rebellious, beautiful. Again, on the bottle it says, Hothead's hot sauce. Hot sauce, not for you, but for us. Using the precious ingredients, creating unique recipes and amazing flavors that we love. Let's start the Hothead's Rebellion. Got that nice peachy color. Wow. Got a lot of spices and pepper in here too, y'all. About a, well, about a salad dressing again, but it's a little lighter. It's not as creamy um, because there is no olive oil. And we're going to get to the ingredients now. All natural ingredients. White vinegar, peaches, orange bell pepper again, sweet onion, orange habanero pepper. So you get the orange color too in there with the peach. Sugar, salt, cinnamon, ground cloves, citric acid, and nutmeg. So yeah, it's not too thick, not too thin, but it's not as creamy as the uh, Phantasm because it doesn't have any olive oil in it, but here we go. Oh, wow. Woo, fruit sauce. Love me some fruit sauces, too. Wow. Can get the peaches right off the bat. Well, I'm getting the cinnamon too. Wow. Vinegar's not overpowering, so I can't wait to taste. This is also a leather medium heat sauce, everybody. Well, I mean it a little creamy, but not as creamy as the other. Alright, Tim Myers, Hothead's official hot sauce. 
This is Peach Cobbler. Habanero and Peach. Grammarville, aka Peppers in Kentucky Living. Wow. Peach. Wow. Wow. Cinnamon. Whoo wee. Makes me think of the holidays coming up. Thanksgiving. All right. Wow, that aftertaste is amazing. Okay. This is what I'm tasting. Oh, wow. The vinegar's not overpowering. Peaches, right, right away. Do get the orange bell. Sweet onion. Oh, my gosh. It, I mean, it's sweet. Got that great onion flavor. Orange habanero. Get you on your tongue. Sugar, get a sweetness from the sugar. Yes, salt's not overpowering. Cinnamon. Yes, right away. And the... Uh, Cloves and nutmeg. The nutmeg is kind of that flavor I was thinking, like, wow. Cloves are a key in here. If you don't have <coughs> all these ingredients, you won't have peach collar. My gosh, that's, that's awesome. And it's another medium heat. It's uh, three flames out of five. That's what the medium heat is. But for a uh, non-chili head, I gave Phantasma six because it's ghost pepper. This is a habanero. Habanero is lower than the uh, ghost pepper. But you get some habaneros ghost pepper heat now. Uh... I'd probably give it a five for non chili head. For someone eating hot stuff, I'd probably give it a three. For me, it's about a one. Got a good sting from both of these sauces now. Got a good little burn. But for me, all together, the burn would be about a uh, two, two and a half. But uh, this one would be another good salad dressing. I'd probably put this one on ice cream. Um, but like I said, Y'all put y'all sauce on whatever you want to put it on and just enjoy it. Um, wow. Great sauces, Tim. Thank you for sending me these. And make sure you go to hotheadsofficial.com. Get you some peach cobbler and phantasm. Y'all will love it. Wow. The flavor is just outstanding. Yeah. Bell pepper cloves are a big wow. Flavor just explodes in your mouth, y'all. Alright. I'm gonna put that right here. Put them both together right there so y'all can take a look. But uh hope y'all have a great rest of your week and weekend. Be safe, be healthy. Got a challenge next week. I will be doing uh, two times the uh, Pocky Chip uh, Challenge 2020. Excuse me. But, um, got some more hot sauce reviews and, um, one or two more, uh, challenges also. But, uh, until next time, this is Jeremy Bell. AKA Peppers in Kentucky Living. I will see you all later.